Darren is going to tell us why Geert Wilders' win in the Netherlands is Brexit 2.0 and the elites ought to watch out. Yep, it's a rare move. Darren's talking about immigration. <laughs> <laughs> right, let's have a natter about what's been unfolding in Dublin this week, shall we? Picture this. Innocent Irish Bens just outside their school, no clue what's about to hit them, get stabbed. The alleged culprit in this crime, an Algerian national. This is the kind of gut-wrenching news that should have all of us down in tools gabbing non-stop about the state of our streets across the West, across Europe. But what do we get instead? Well, we get politicals and the media in Ireland, rather than soothing a public rightly spooked, are banging on about slapping hate crime laws retrospectively on the so-called far-right spectre. They'd rather wag fingers at this phantom menace than face up to the elephant in the room. Mass migration. It's the pet project that they've been pushing and now they're turning a blind eye to its consequences. And I'll bet you my last quid that folk are more scared stiff about their kids being knifed or their neighbours being offed than some riled up protest. And then there's this kerfuffle over Gert Wilders getting elected in Holland. You'd think that the world had ended. More fuss over that than the safety of our kids, than the very fabric of our communities. They're being ripped apart. I say wakey wakey, it's time to stop skirting around the bush and tackle these thorny issues head on. It's net zero, it's mass migration, it's lawlessness, it's a replacement of democracy for elite technocracy that swept the likes of wielders to power. The West deserves better than this hush, hush and sidestepping by the powers that be. And what about us, right? What about us here in Blighty? Vote Labour and you're signing up for unbridled immigration. Chuck your vote at the Tories and what do you get? Same old. Same old. They're just two sides of the same wrinkly old behind. It's as plain as the nose on your face. No matter how we tick our ballots, the thin-skinned bigwigs in Westminster aren't moving a muscle on policy. So you're worried about Gert Wilders getting in power in Europe. Mark my words, this is a big blinking sign. Can you see it yet? If you thought Brexit shook things up, brace yourself. What's coming next is going to blow the roof off.